My name is Joseph Wartman, president of Detroit Radiant Products Company. We are most well known for our reverberate family of infrared heaters. We've been doing it for 65 years and I'm very proud of the team that's here. When people think of reverberate, they, they see us as the leaders. We're the pioneers. We are creating new technology. We're pushing boundaries. We're at our main headquarters today. And in the back, there's an uh, ISO testing laboratory. So we actually will design product here by concept, we'll bring it to life on our high technology pieces of equipment, and then we'll put it into the lab for testing and certification. For the new product that I am excited to be talking about today, the REV series, it's, it is revolutionary. The heater is unlike anything else in the market, and I think this is the biggest breakthrough in infrared technology since we introduced two-stage heating in the early 1990s. There has to be a dozen features that haven't been seen, and it's primarily because the process of making our aluminum reflector is an extrusion versus a break or a bend. This heater is a game changer. There's nothing like it on the market out there. Insulated reflectors actually are not that new. What's revolutionary about this insulated reflector, rather than wasting the energy absorbed into the insulation, we use the natural inducer fan that's already running to draw the air out of the air pockets that are in the extruded aluminum frame. We now extract that energy and use it for preheat combustion air. So when we think of heat transfer, we think of conduction, convection, and radiant energy. The goal of the REV was to minimize the conduction, minimize the convection, and maximize the radiant energy or the effective heat at the floor level. Through the possibilities with extruded aluminum, we were able to create this void in the reflector. We not only decrease the convective heat by drawing for preheated air, we are also reducing the conduction and have been able to take our clearance to combustibles down from a six inch top clearance to a two inch top clearance. The insulated air pockets that come on the reflector are going to allow a tighter clearance window onto the heater for the structure around it. Clearances are a big deal because of the standpoint that you might have obstacles that you're trying to meet within the space that if you have too large of a clearance window, you're not gonna be able to place the heater where you actually need it the most. We have worked really hard to remove all obstacles for the versatility of this heater when it comes to the applications. The heater comes with a sliding track system for its reflector. Rather than having to add onto your structure to make those hanging points be met, you can now adjust those hanging points to actually adhere to the structure itself. With me being in the sales department, I'm often having to ask additional questions because I don't know what the space is gonna entail. I now have opened up the world of where I can put those heaters without having to know all that information up front. This is a great versatile product to be able to place anywhere in the space that you desire. There's no other uh, heater out there on the market that has a flexible design reflector that can be reconfigured on site. If you're trying to heat a large open space and you want to change the configuration of the reflectors, it can do that. If you've got a narrow, confined space, it'll do that as well. We have designed this to be multi-configurable, allowing us to have unique installations, whether that be a wide spread, a narrow spread, or an open throw, which allows us to eliminate the need for additional accessories to mount this heater on an angle. There's a lot of debate in our industry about reflector geometry. One geometry is better than the other. This heater puts an end to that debate. This reflector has endless geometric configuration. So we don't need to talk about geometry anymore. We need to focus back on you know, a good heater and a high efficient heater, which this is. We introduced the concept of single pass versus dual pass reflector design. And this heater has both. When I say the term single pass, I mean 100% of the rays that are emitted off the tube reflect off the reflector and travel to the floor. A single pass reflector is also referred to as a 100% design efficient reflector. When I say the term dual pass, what I mean by that is some of the rays are emitted off of the tube, reflect off of the reflector, and travel back to the tube. What this does is it increases the surface temperature of the tube, and through the stefan boltzmann law, we know that that will increase the radiant output. Certain models within the REV family are able to achieve an infrared factor of 15, as well as a radiant emission value in excess of 110. As with any object that heats up and cools down, you get expansion. One advantage of the REV is we've got these hangers that simulate a floating tube. This allows the tube to translate independently of the reflector, eliminating the need for an expansion joint. There's so many di dynamics to this uh, heater as far as how to direct the energy. I've never seen a heater that can solve the customer's needs 
in the capacity that this heater can. There are consumers out there that are extremely energy conscious that demand high performance and high efficiency. This solves both of those problems. We are able to get very high thermal efficiencies and very high infrared factors. And this heater and the shield that we designed for it, plus the dozen or so other unique patent pending features, it's a niche product that has durability and rigidity that nothing else like that in the industry has. We are always trying to develop and push boundaries for greener technology, for higher efficiencies, for customer features, and this heater does all of that.